It's December 20th. In today's reading, the writer of Hebrews explains the indispensable role that faith plays, not just in the lives of God's people, but the larger role that faith plays in God's economy. He explains that really nothing that has happened in God's plan for world redemption has happened apart from faith. Faith begins in the mind and the heart. In that instant, we consider the promise that God has made, that idea of what can be, even though we don't yet see it occur. We act and move toward that promise or event with the belief and expectation that it can happen. It's not blind hope, but it's a belief in the promises that God has revealed. The writer of Hebrews recites 18 heroes of the faith, from Abel through Samuel, who believed God for things that had never before occurred or went places that they had never been to, or attempted things that had never before been accomplished or even attempted. He shows that faith has always been inexorably intertwined into everything that anyone has ever done for God. As a follower of Jesus, faith is inexorably intertwined into everything that you do. Everything one does in the kingdom of God is done by faith and through faith. Another way to think of faith is that it is that intimate part of you that pushes you onward toward what will someday be a fulfillment of all of what God has promised you, that great reward when all of your hopes, all of your dreams, the sum total of all of your goals and aspirations are met. Here's today's application. What is the status of your faith? Are you putting your faith out there to believe God for something meaningful or significant? Or are you content with where everything is right now? What do you think God wants you to ask of Him? What does God want you to believe Him for? Now here's today's prayer. 